here's one that you guys are going to find pretty weird. But how is golf like riding a bike? Well, most of you know, if you talk to a good golfer or even some instructors, they tell you what, what to do or what they think you should do or what they think that they do. And then you do that exact thing and your result is completely different. Well, maybe they don't know what they're talking about. So I saw an interesting video the other day by Veritasium. I'll leave a link to it below. But he made a bicycle that only turns in one direction. And it was impossible to ride. And nobody really understood how or why you couldn't ride this bike. Because if you ask anybody, how do you ride a bike? They say, well, once you get your balance on the bike, you simply learn to lean in the direction you want to go. And the bike turns that direction. Every single person will tell you that. And every one of them will be wrong. So every one of these people who's learned to ride a bike has learned to do something that they're completely unaware of. And they do it every time. And when I tell you what that thing is, you'll be surprised. But what it is, is your center of gravity is on top of the bike. So when you want to turn right, you actually turn the bike left. The bike goes out this way, makes your center of gravity fall in the direction you want to go. And then you turn and you catch yourself. And that's how you get into that turn. If you were to simply turn in the direction you'd want to go, the bike would go that way and you would fall to the other side. So I found this really interesting because we all know how to ride a bike, but none of us are aware of of exactly how. We all think we know how. We, our brains know how, our bodies know how. But if you were to tell somebody, just lean in the direction you want to go, it will not work for them. They will fall every time. If you've ever, if you've ever followed a bicyclist in your car and they're going to make a right turn, you know that their bike goes out to the left before it makes that right. And you think, why did they do that? Well, they had to do that. And the golf swing, I think, is very similar in that people always say, oh, this is what I do, and, you know, I just do this, and blah, 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 this and this. And then none of them are actually doing that. Um, you know, God, what do they say that, that you want to just get the, the elbow in front? Well, let's, let's see if just getting the elbow in front does anything. Okay, well, that, that gave me no power, nothing. All I did was move my elbow in front. There's, there's a purpose to these moves, and you have to understand the purpose or the cause, not, not the effect. You can't, you can't just move your elbow into the front and expect that you're going to get all the power that comes with moving it properly. Right? Um, that's what my golf channel is all about. Or that's what my golf lessons are all about. There are things in the golf swing nobody seems to really understand. Like our force needs to be directed that way. We do not swing toward the target. I would be, let me, well, let me try that. I'm going to actually try to throw my club that way and, and see what, what happens here. Oh. Well, you know what? That looks like a lot of people's swings that I've seen. Let's see if, see if I can do some more idiocy like that. Oh. Okay. I think I did a bit of a hybrid there. But when you know which direction to swing the ball or the club, which seems, I mean, the ball's not out there. The ball's there. Why would we swing in any direction other than that one? And, you know, uh, it just makes perfect sense.
And I think that is the main move that everyone does who's good at golf. But they know they 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 learned it when they were so young, or they learned it in such a way that it it was unaware to them. I'm not really sure, but you you just you can't swing the club that way. You just can't. You know that that motion is 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 a nightmare. I mean, imagine just trying. And let's hell. Let me try. You know that's why everybody gets that over the top. They Get the club out. Then they got to pull it across. So. <laughs> yep. That's it. But. If I send that club. Or the force. Straight down that way. Like a javelin. The ball flies. Like Mo Norman said, the feeling of greatness. <laughs> I'm kidding. But every once in a while, you can get that feeling of greatness in the golf swing, and that is pretty cool.